All right, dudes, how's it going? Good afternoon. Bit of a weird stream today, and I apologize for the up and down of the stream to begin with. Usually, I, well, recently, I've been streaming with 4 megasecond bitrate, and Twitch did not want to know tonight. I thought it was my connection. So I did a um, restart my connection, but nope. Twitch does not want to know about 4 meg today. Fair enough, fair enough. I guess it's E3 going off and all of a shit, so it's probably a bit... It, it must definitely be on a strain. Anyway, like I said, a bit of a random stream. Bit of Mario Kart, bit of Killer Instinct, maybe some Cow Strike Go if there's enough people around. Bit of Dungeon Mans. Bit of a random stream. Right. Let's find something to kick my ass. Should not be hard in Killer Instinct. Let's try lobbies first. The lobbies are... I was a bit disappointed with lobbies in Killer Instinct. Waited so long for them. And then they added them. And they're a bit flaky. There's like desyncs and disconnects and you get booted out of the lobby for no reason and shit like that. And it's not been patched in over a month. Well, it doesn't seem like the lobbies have been patched anyway. They seem as broke as what they were when they were introduced in the full gore patch. What is a Dungeon Mans? It's a roguelike. Kind of identical-ish, but not as deep as Tome is. Yeah, let's go, dude. Oh shit! No, I just meant to. I just meant to actually go, not actually um, look at his gamer card. No, I guess that works. Are we going? I don't need to toggle battle. Yeah, here we go. Even though I'm rank twelve and he's rank ten, that means nothing, because I'm an old school rank twelve from like months and months and months and months and months ago. Is my color color two, I think. Was that black for the glacis? I'm not sure. Oh, did you? What do you think of the Smash Tony? I thought it was all right. I thought it was all right. I watched the entirety of it, all two and a half hours and stuff. I thought it was all right. Certainly looking forward to Smash more than I was before it. I was looking forward to it before, but oh, oh fuck me. Miracle Glacius, show me how it's done. Yep, this Glacius knows. Glacius versus Glacius is a really weird, oddball kind of match. It's who controls the shatters. Sorry, the hails. Oh, fuck. Oh, there was no way it was it like. What was it doing? It's who controls the air normals and the hails. Fuck, that was a bad idea. No, you don't. Wow, nice. Oh. Who controls those air normals? Oh, shit. Greedy bastard going for that ever. This glacius fucking knows. See the weird fucking game that we both play. Oh shit. No. All in those. Oh. No, it was an ever. Of course it was an ever. Oh, we didn't finish it. No. No. Easy now. No, 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 no. Thought he might try that shit. No, no, I was doing that. No, I was doing that. I was doing that. I was trying to do that. That exact same thing I was trying to fucking throw as well. Should have teched it. Never mind. He knows. He fucking knows. He knows. And he knows I know, which is why he's playing even more like that. He fucking knows. Um, okay. Chris wanna brought the right version there. No, I should have done that. Fuck that. Whoops, it is it. It's all right. Ah, cheeky. No. No, it was medium shit. Oh my god, no. Fuck. 
fuck me, I got some work here. I knew this Glacius from the fucking first five seconds. I knew this guy knew how to play Glacius versus Glacius. Nope. I'm so fucked. Oh, okay. No, oh, I needed that. No, oh, cheeky bitch. Nice, well played, well played. Yep. Glacius versus Glacius. Such a... It's the strangest mirror match in the game, in my opinion. Just like his face. Claire points out. Quite correct. Oh, of course, back at bus when there's fucking two more people in here now. That's always the case. I swear I got it for the one. It has still been like, for as long as I'd have won, there's just been that one guy until I fucking lose, and then there's fucking two guys extra in the room. Not bad though, not bad. Knew straight away with that Glacius. He knew, he knows, he knows the mirror match. You can just tell what way he wants to begin with. It's like, I'm only gonna throw Hales and Jumping Fierce and Medium Kick. What do you think of that? It's like, I've seen that style before. That's the only style for Glacius versus Glacius. Shatter. You know, the big column of fucking beam of light thing he does. That's useless. Glacius versus Glacius. Well, it's not useless, but you've got to be a damn good Glacius, certainly in practice. Which I am not. I think there's only like three combos between me and Glacius. I think there's already been more combos landed here. Yep, now it's. Oh. Maybe not now, but... I really like Fulgar as well. I was going to main him when he got released, but... He's really good, but I just don't like the way he builds meter. I like exploiting the fact if you hit somebody on blocking killer instinct, you get a shit ton of meter. And Fulgar does not build meter that way. He has to manually build it. Don't matter how much shit you block... Well... If you block with full gore, you're giving them meter. If they block your shit, when you're full gore, it means nothing. You don't get any meter out of it. You've got to build it yourself. He is fucking crazy, though. Really. Good high-low mix-up, good teleport, good anti-air for Sadira and shit. Well, hi, I think she did indeed. She'll turn the webcam on. Well, come activate. There we go. I think that's all correct. She's kind of in it. No. <laughs> no. No. Oh. Let me just um, tilt the camera to there. That's better. Should just about to get her in. There we go. She's in. <laughs> Fucking old glaciers. What happened? One minute it was equal, and then boom! <laughs> what the fuck? Oh, he's going for that double ultra! But this is just a random lobby, this. I don't think anybody... The only guy I know that's definitely got Killer Instinct and actually plays it is Blood Reaper. I didn't seem like Blood Reaper's around. No, he's not. Hi Liam, dude. Alright, Mr. Grumpy. Afternoon, dude. Let's see what Makforovsky can do. Or would it be Makforovsky? Fuck knows. Maybe one's not an actual uh, part of his name and just trying to... I don't, I don't know. You never know we Xbox fucking names. Even I've got a deranged... What the fuck is that for Glacius? I've never seen that head. And his entire skin's a bit weird. It's all metallic. I've never seen that. What the fuck? It's like a fucking ice demon. They didn't mention to be an ice alien. Get your killer instinct right, Claire. Ice alien. And I've never seen that skin. Like I say, it's only been this... Uh, funnily enough, I got Ultra Street Fighter 4 on the Xbox, played it for an hour and a half, and then went, you know what, Killer Instinct. So it's only been the past week since so I've been playing Killer Instinct again, and only a couple of sessions. It's actually Ultra Street Fighter 4 that got me back into Killer Instinct. Hey, Otis, you've tried out Ultra Street 5-4 yet? Yeah, I have indeed, I have indeed. Solid enough. 
Like I said, don't get me wrong, old, old Street Fighter 4 is a solid enough fighting game, it's just... I prefer Killer Instinct. If I'm going to play a fighting game, I prefer Killer Instinct at the moment. At least until Smash comes out. Yeah, she's still in there. This, this is pretty solid, actually. Plays kind of like how I used to play when I were in practice. He likes his shoulder charge, like aggression, so you don't expect it out of Glacius. You think he's just gonna zone you, and he does shit like that. He just pokes you in the air, throws out some hails and stuff like that. Flags you out a little bit with shatters, like, I'm gonna do it! If it hits, it hits, if not, no worries. But he's just poking you, looking for shoulder charges. Plays just how I did when I were in practice. Just like old me. Not not at the moment. Not at the moment. See when I didn't practice, didn't if Sable were going to sit at that screen range, it'd have been fucking shattered. But it, like I say, it is like how I used to play, like very aggressive with the throws and the shoulder charges. Some of the main difference. I like me um, Shadow Puddle Punch, and I ain't seen him do that once yet. Ho Very nice, very nice. OTG, did you see the Splatoon video? I did, I watched about an hour of Splatoon as well. It was pretty interesting, does that? A slightly different take on your average arena shooter. Certainly better than seeing another Call of Duty type affair or something like that. I'd say, I mean, this is that new Battlefield game. Battlefield Hardline or something like that. That looks pretty interesting. A bit like a scaled down Battlefield, like less vehicles, more... Personnel combat, I don't know, but that looks pretty interesting, but Splatoon, I would say, was more interesting. It was a bit different. I like paint. I like paint. First blood! Liam rules the, rules the air normals. No, you don't. <laughs> Kind of trading over here. Oh, damn it. I don't think I'm getting the better part of this. I should not have let him have time to do that. No, I'm not getting the better part of this. Cheeky bitch! Very nice. No way that didn't hurt. Oh, nice! He's so... He knows this matchup. Pass that, I'm gonna get you eventually. Cheeky bastard! Went on the ground! He knows this matchup so well. I'm digging his fucking druidy icy skin. Oh damn, I've just given him a game away now. No. Damn it, I don't have no instinct to get out of it this time. Whoa, no, whoa, no, no. Nice. Well, at least it was a, um, a closer first round this time. No, you don't. I fucking rule that jumping fierce. Oh, 
Oh, no way he did that. No, it was obviously Evit. Oh, it's going to sting like a bit. Oh, okay, dropped it. No. Whoa, shit. Did not need stuff like that. Oh, that's going to cost me so He won't fuck it up this time. No, he'll cash it out. Damn it. I had a feeling he might throw some out soon. Damn, I don't have time. 15 seconds. No, shut up, fucking hail. That's got him. Oh, played the Ice Armor versus Ice Armor. Good game, dude. Very good game. Damn, he knows this matchup. He's. I fought a lot of Glacis's in uh, mirror matches and stuff like that. He's got to be the best one. I mean, I'm out of practice. Uh, in practice, a few months back, probably would have beaten him. But that don't mean he ain't fucking damn good. Very good game. I saw versus I saw apart from I fucked up. I should have gone into a super straight away afterwards. After ah, oh. if I got into that super, but no worries. Good game, damn good game. It's a solid glacis, and he knows the mirror. Yes, he's got all the fucking horse armor. That that is that is that helmet he's got is horse armor. It's fucking terrible. It may as well be. You could fit that helmet on a fucking horse. It is the definition of horse armor DLC. It's fucking disgusting looking and could actually fucking be attached to a horse. It's the, it's, it's the right fucking size for an horse, isn't it? Or a rhino. Full guards? I guess it's kind of like a Wolverine robot, but I think... I don't know, you could say, well, it's like a Protoss robot, anything with claws. I guess his, his claws are similar more to Protoss, but... Rubberine. Fulgar's awesome. Really, really solid character. And they've done well with all the characters in this. I think Orchid's probably the most uninspired, but actually plays pretty fun. My only gripes are Orchid's a little bit dull-looking compared to the rest of the cast. You know, you've got, like, robots and ice aliens. You've got, well, skeletal pirates. And, you know, fucking all kinds of shit. Even, like, fucking the Shoto of this game, like, has got a sword, at least, and he's, like, a Tibetan kind of fucking monk kind of dude. And then you've got Orchid. Regular lass. I mean, I know she's got, like, fucking cat power or some shit like that, whatever it is, but... You know, Sadia is like a spider lady and stuff. Thunder's like this big, huge fucking... I don't, is he technically a Red Indian anymore? I don't fucking... I don't, I don't know anymore. But... And then you've got Orchid, just regular old lass. It's fair enough, I guess they need some kind of like, regular sex appeal kind of character or something like that, but... I think she's got her own playstyle as well, she's not just like... You know, let's just add a lass with tits in here or like that. She actually, she's got her own playstyle. She's alright. I see what I mean. Mech Glace is a woman with frosty tits and there you go. It's like, no, it's not just sex. Oh, fuck no, this guy's dying. I told you, Full Girl's pretty good. Well, like I was saying, like, I... I honestly think, uh, like, months back when I went in practice, I could have beaten the Glacis in a mirror match. Peep! I, I do like Full Gauze ending. Yeah, a few months ago, I probably could have beaten uh, that Glacis in a mirror, but... To give the guy fair credit, it's not a few months ago, is it? It's now, and uh, out of practice or not, that's an excuse. I would main Orchid, but fuck getting an X-Bone. I don't blame you, dude. Like, there is literally this game. <laughs> 
This game and Dead Rising 3, they're the only reasons to own this motherfucker. And you know Dead Rising 3 is probably coming to PC at some point. So... I'd say the Wii U is the best um, console, really, exclusive-wise. And even then, it's a bit thin on the ground. Yeah, when the Zelda out for it and Smash, plus everything else at the moment, an expanded virtual console store, the Wii U is good for the console. I mean, um, October onwards, PlayStation and Xbox will probably get a bit better, but I think um, Wii U is probably going to have... It's been a bit slow at the gate, but it's probably going to have a good year from, like, now onwards. For the next year, it's probably going to be pretty solid. Chisel? Link? Was it Link? It looked a bit feminine for Link. I always thought it was a girl Link to that. Yeah, I mean, I know Link's fairly feminine, but it looked proper girly to me. Fair enough. How can I be part of this lobby? Um, well this was just a random one that I joined. So if you can find the, um, the host, which I'll say in a second. Uh. Like I say, once Fulgar gets his shit together and we go back to the, um, lobby. He wants it, doesn't he? He wants his, he wants his fucking... Hyper is a shit for the finish. Are you gonna come kick me ass, Menzo? <laughs> no doubt. I think anybody can kick me ass at this game. Like I say, I don't pretend to be very good at Killer Instinct. Oh, to compound the problem, I've not played in months, and to further compound the problem, I um, I don't know what people. I, I don't think Glacius is considered the hardest character anymore. Would that be Spinal now the hardest character to play? But. Certainly Glacius is not easy to play. Should play a bit of Jago as well, actually. Get me ass kicked to Jago, though. Jago's easier to play than Glacius, but at the same time, like... You need to know how to extract... He's got loads of fucking frame traps and shit like that, and, um... Oh. Well, what was his name? Devin the Dude's room. Should come up as the, um... But the E in Devin is a free, something like that. Devin the dude. The, uh, I think the maximum lobby size is 8. But it depends what they've set it to. I don't know why how it always comes. Oh, this full guard's gonna work. Rare bit of lag for Killer Instinct as well. He knows where I want. I'm just trying to feel him out. Just see kind of what he's about. He seems to know that I want to be in the air. I don't know how to break Fulgore. Nope, clearly that was not correct. Get the fuck off. Whoa, I need to watch out for Fulgore's teleport. Damn it, he fucking shot it before he even finished casting it. They still have to worry about blocking with full guard. It does hurt though. I don't know how to get on the motherfucker. Whoa! Okay, I think he lagged as well. Wow, I don't think you get to block that in time. Oh shit. Right into it. Nice. 
Nice, need a bit of um, bit of damage on him. Oh shit! That teleport, man. They did so many characters with teleport since I played. Fucking Spinal and Fulgore. Oh shit. I just don't know. I just don't know. Oh. Nope. Damn it, wrong one. Seems to have a better zoning game than me. Oh shit, it's not gonna let me um I can't I can't zoom forward and I can't jump in the air. Fuck me, it's really hard to approach him. Well that helps. Hey up. Hey up. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, whoa, whoa, none of that fucking. Oh, walked right into him. Fuck. Well, that was fucking silly. What did I do that for? What's he doing? Oh, he's disconnecting. That's what's happening. Or I am. This is, this is what I said right at the beginning. What? He counted me as losing that. Oh, the lobbies, man. This is what I was saying. Right, it's it's been like, what? Less than half an hour playing and already a fucking, like, weird lobby thing. It's like, oh yeah, I disconnected, but yet strangely managed to stay in the lobby. How is How can you even do that? There is no way of actually forcing that. Like, you either disconnect and you're thrown out of the lobby, or you're playing. You know? You can't just, like... Quit the dashboard, but don't actually quit the dashboard. Quit it back to the lobby. Or unplug the internet, but yeah, duh. <laughs> you know? What? Crazy. I'm pulling that back a little bit. Time was against me there, but still, I was pulling it back. I just don't know how to approach fucking full door. That was really, really hard. He's got my shoulder charge. Although it seems slightly better. He's got a straightforward projectile, which completely shuts down my shoulder charge as well. Yeah, how is this guy approaching him? Basically holding forward. I guess that's one way of approaching. Hold forward or shoulder charge. I kind of think he's gotten lucky so far. Because the full guard I was playing before would not have allowed me to just hold forward. Oh uh, no, what the fuck? He wouldn't 